The road to state continues for a few area large school ball clubs today, the Elite Eight. The sites for both baseball and softball teams. In Class 3A baseball, Sacred Heart Griffin taking on normal U High. Bottom of the second, bases loaded, Tyler May drops one. Just fair on the first baseline. That would score in three runs. SHG still leads four to three. On top of seven, Cole Daly at the plate. And he hits it short to second. But the error at first would bring in Cole Evers. And that would be the last run of the game. SHG moves on to the super sectional, 6-3 the final. It's unreal. Uh, you know, I've never gone this far in baseball. You know, through grade school, uh, the farthest I ever made it was sectional semifinal. Um, so you know, I'm just, I'm enjoying the ride. Our defense comes in, pitching has come through when it needs to. When, when it's time to shut down, they shut down. We'll keep going one at a time, see what we can do Monday. Also, congratulations to SHG catcher Mitch Trees. He was selected in the 11th round of the MLB draft by the Cincinnati Reds. It's an unbelievable feeling. Um, you know, I, I'm honored to be able to get to do something that not, not very many people get to do. And I mean, I don't, it's just it's a pretty crazy feeling. I, I don't even know how to explain it. I'm going to focus on this, this season here and get these games done and hopefully win a state championship. Then I'll take care of all that after the season gets over. To Class 3A softball, Glenwood and Mattoon meeting for rights to the Lincoln sectional plaque. Brianna Graham in the circle for Glenwood. She goes the distance and makes the strikeout. The Mattoon down one, nothing. Caitlin Fisher hits it into the fielder's choice. The throwing error by the shortstop allows Ivy Nichols to score and tie the ball game up. But the Titans would take the lead for good. Parker Bandy with that sack wide to left field. Amanda Balster. Scores on the play. Glenwood wins the sectional championship two to one. It's just a matter of executing pitches, and Bree's been, you know, doing a phenomenal job and defensively been really good. I mean, we made a mistake in that one inning, but, uh, you know, kids stood up and, and played as hard as they could and had fun, and we end up on the, on the right ends. Glenwood will meet Columbia in the Mattoon Super Sectional Monday at 4 30 p.m.